after rolling, then you cut. Eh, then where I put the banana? Welcome back to another episode of Wild Fun. Today we'll be seeing who can cook the best Prata dish. And we've got Prata from Spring Home Theatre to help us out. So each of us has 30 minutes to cook the best Prata dish and our judges later on will decide who is the best and who's playing for today. We have Cece, we have Ling Yi, we have me and we have Terence the chef then. Nobody, nobody. Let's go! Today I'm making uh, tacos using Prata because these ones look like I, I, I should be able to handle them. And uh, for my for my tacos, it's a prawn tacos with guacamole sauce uh, with uh, uh, whatever I feel like showing on lah, huh? Today we're gonna do a very very humble dish. Okay, so we have to use this instant spring home tea tea prata. So um, I'm just going to to use very humble ingredients. Uh, this is my main ingredient over here, which is a spring onion. So I'm just going to combine Chinese and Indian to create a dish called. I don't know what am I doing here to be honest. I uh, try to think of something that is simple. I have tuna, the two piece of cheese that I stole from uh, Nick. <laughs> then I have hot dog. Um, and then two eggs, one tomato and one uh, banana and um, Nutella. That's about it. My prata dish is inspired by the old school childhood snack, the prata hot dog. Turkey bacon, I have sausage, and I have ham, and I have cheese. And because I believe that the prata is so good, you, you look at my shirt, you look at my shirt. In prata, we trust. Why am I not making a simple dish? This is how you take out the avocado seed, right? You chop, you turn, and it's out. Well, I show you how to cut, huh? Yeah, you cut like that, huh? Oh, okay, okay. You learn a bit more. Can, can. Then you cook about your Chinese stuff. I have to know if the pan is hot. This is what I learned from Darren the chef. Then you put your hand and you touch it, and if you burn your pan, it's hot. Am I doing it right? Hey, how come you want to try, huh? Hello! Peel the banana. Um, chop the banana. You ate! I really don't know what am I doing. After rolling, then you cut. Eh, then where I put the banana? I haven't put the banana in eh. Why roll it? <laughs> oh shit, my ham got hole. <laughs> got hole eh. How ah? I, I just eat all. I keep eating my ingredients eh. This is a problem. Eh, I also want to Mmm, it's good. <laughs> Whoa! Perfect! Look at that! Look at that! Look at that! Look at this gorgeous Prada! I'm going to bake this. Um, 170. <laughs> hey, can somebody taste my guacamole, Terrence? Maybe a bit more so. Actually, it's not good. I just tell her it's good. <laughs> Okay, so the trick in cooking fried shallots is to make sure that you keep stirring. It's very, very important. It will just get darker and darker until it goes golden brown. So for the prawn, I'm going to season with the paprika. Uh, this prawn is cooked okay. I think they might get out the kitchen down though. Okay, bad news, it's slightly overcooked. So what I'm doing now is to heat up more ghee and this will go into this. So this is just all-purpose flour and just a spice mix of curry powder, garlic powder. So this is my secret over here, hot oil. So what I'm doing now is stretching the prata dough a little bit more. Okay, so what you have to do is put a bit of this yosu on the dough. Green onion, a lot, a lot. A lot. So this is where I'm very scared, alright? Because uh, when you do tong yo ping, you are able to stretch it. But now we are using instant prata dough, but in in ti I trust. Ah, I'm so nervous for Terrence. I'm so nervous for Terrence. Because I want my food to be hot, to be served to the judges. So I think I'll just like chill here a bit and eat my food. Oh, look at it, rising. Mm. Next, Prata is looking very, very promising. 
I was born to make prata. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. I go Simpang Bedok ah. The prata look exactly like this. Exactly like this. Eh! Hey, no way! It's not happening! Am I supposed to like do it again? What have you made so far? I made breakfast for myself. For breakfast, I think that's not bad. You want some ham? No, thank you. She just wanna like, you know, tell people that my food is good. <laughs> I'm just uh, oiling the, the, the paper so that it doesn't stick. I have to say, I'm, I'm quite impressed. All right. As Chinese, I'm impressed. Okay, I'm just going to go for medium heat. You don't want it to be too hot, burn. Too low, become soggy. Too hot, chao ta. All right, I'm going to turn it over. This is a good color. My food have to be served hot leh. Alright guys, I'm done. Okay, so I made a uh, prawn guacamole tacos using prata and uh, that's it. Let's bring on the first dish. This is chapalang. Let's start with the savoury guys. Wow, wow, wow. Yes, Chalanti! Even Jason! <laughs> eh, very bad, man. All I taste is tuna. I can barely even taste the prata. Let me tell you what. This has to be the best prata I ever had. Okay. Because the ingredient can't make it. Just the prata itself <laughs> is good. The burnt taste <laughs> dessert. <laughs> I like this one. Mm. You should have not served this one yeah. and just served the nut. Correct. But honestly, the, the puff... The puff is good. The puff is the killer. It looks black, la, but I okay. I eat already, I'm like, wow, it's so good. For taste-wise, I give you a one. It's a bit chow ta, that's why it's a one. I give it two. La. I don't really enjoy the tuna like that. Thank you. I see, I give you two points also. Good effort. Okay, next one. Aesthetic. It is aesthetics. Two la, I give you two. Uh, for aesthetic, I give one. Okay. Because I don't like the... Like that. Mm. Okay. I also give one. And last for creativity, I think I'll give you a four. I give you a five. Same for me, I give you five. Now your total score, would you like to know? Yeah. Out of twenty out of forty-five points, CC you have scored twenty-three points. Hey, not bad! This wow. is uh, a mix between Indian and Chinese. So it's using prata, but using the technique of Chong Yo Pig. This looks beautiful. It looks like something that can be served in a restaurant. It's oh, hey, so oh, nice. Oh, oh, you very poor. Let me try. Ah. Mm. Mm. Wow, it's so amazing. Eh. Okay, let's judge on taste. I think I have to give it a five. Ah. I'll give it a four. Because I think it's missing sauce. We can add something also. Chili. Yeah. chili. i okay without chili. I'll give you five. Mm. For aesthetics, right? I will give it a 4.5. Yeah, I'll give 4.5 as well. I give. Three. Creativity. Oh. Okay, I would have to say this is really creative. Lah. Five. Easy five. I give you a five as well. Lah. Who would have thought of uh, making that from this? I will give you four. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, but wait, he prepared the shallot beforehand. Yes! He cut beforehand. Yeah, minus two points. Okay, for your lateness in your delivery of your dish, I'm sorry we have to give you a deduction of one point. Yes. So it's yeah. a serious offense. Mm. Serious as a yeah. chef, you should be ashamed of yourself. <laughs> so, Chef Terence, your initial final points were 39 out of 45. That's a distinction. But now, because you have deducted three points, it is 36 out of 45. Well done. I have prepared you today prawn tacos with guacamole. Taste, I give it a three. So taste-wise, I would have given you a five, but the mango is not distributed. Okay, my final score for taste, four. For me, I can only give you two because I don't eat this. <laughs> okay, next is aesthetic. I give it a five. 
Wow. I will give you a three. What is this? I don't know why okay. am I supposed to do with this. Actually, can I adjust my score? I would like to adjust my score to a four. I will give you a five because you hide this very, very well. <laughs> it's inside. Okay, for creativity, right? I have to give this a five. La. Four. La. Okay, five, five, five. Oh. There's something else later, don't worry. Wow. Something else yeah. done, right? A four. Because with this, eh? Hello. With a prata, eh? To make this, eh? Wow. It's the first time I see this. The time extra you spent. Six minutes and seventeen seconds. Oh, I make three, wow! Nobody yeah, asked you to make three. Like, if I go to a restaurant, I order one one plate of something. You give me three plate for what? <laughs> <laughs> me, your final points are oh, forty-five. That's thirty-five. Thirty-two. But you were late. The final score is now thirty-two points. <laughs> I will teach you not to be late next time when you make a dish. <laughs> Uh, this is my dish. It is called It's Prata Time. It resembles a clock because I feel like Prata. <laughs> I feel like Prata can be eaten at any time of day. This, this Prata is from Spring Home or also known as Tiitia. Yeah, you can get it at it any leading supermarkets out there available. If you look at it, right, you can see a lot of hole. Actually, I quite like it. Of course. But honestly, I think it's the taste, not so much the cooking. I want to make it easy for any kids at home to try for themselves. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I think taste-wise, right, I think I'll give it a 4.5. I love meat as well, but I like some veggie in there. There's mm. nothing I... No, 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 no such thing as veggie. <laughs> no, you don't tell what the judge has to say. The judge will tell you how it feels. <laughs> yeah. Ah! Yeah. The taste-wise, I will give... Uh, 3. And you put the cheese with the sauce, the combination is good, but it's not original. Now we're talking about taste. Now we're talking about taste, not, not creativity. Mm. Okay, the taste is a three. Okay, I think the plating is really bad, la, Nick. Come on. <laughs> if you say good, I'll slap you. <laughs> like, do you honestly can you honestly tell me there was a clock? <laughs> <laughs> okay la, I give you a a, a one on, on plating. Two. Come on, as a writer, as your creative vision. <laughs> I'm not really here to read a press release. I'm here to taste food. I will say one. Okay, I think creativity, uh, I will give it a, a one as well. Oh, but you finished on time, uh, which was very good. So I'll give you a one. I will give you a three. And he, and he fed the cameraman the, at the crew, everyone. So there's an additional... Add three more points for you, because you cook for everyone with your remaining I time. So, not Nick, bad. your final score was 19. But you fed the crew. You were kind. God is gracious. He watches over you. And he now gives you three points. Your final score is now 22 out of 45. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. Can we show the points on top of their head? So thank you so much judges for tasting all our creations. So guys, share with us your very own Spring Home Prata inspired creations and stand with $200 in cash or vouchers by T E Tia. And comment down below whose dish you think was the best. You can try mine if you're there. Thanks for watching. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye bye. You know what's salty? Lee. After she's lost. <laughs> <laughs> Not as salty as your uh, Tong Yobi. Yes. <laughs>